Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Jeremiah chapter 38, beginning at verse 14 and ending at verse 28. This is the New King James Version. Then Zedekiah the king sent and had Jeremiah the prophet brought to him at the third entrance of the house of the Lord. And the king said to Jeremiah, I will ask you something. Hide nothing from me. Jeremiah said to Zedekiah, If I declare it to you, will you not surely put me to death? And if I give you advice, you will not listen to me. So Zedekiah the king swore secretly to Jeremiah, saying, As the Lord lives, who made our very souls, I will not put you to death, nor will I give you into the hand of these men who seek your life. Then Jeremiah said to Zedekiah, Thus says the Lord, the God of hosts, the God of Israel, If you surely surrender to the king of Babylon's princes, then your soul shall live. This city shall not be burned with fire, and you and your house shall live. But if you do not surrender to the king of Babylon's princes, then this city shall be given into the hand of the Chaldeans. They shall burn it with fire, and you shall not escape from their hand. And Zedekiah the king said to Jeremiah, I am afraid of the Jews who have defected to the Chaldeans, lest they deliver me into their hand and they abuse me. But Jeremiah said, They shall not deliver you. Please obey the voice of the Lord, which I speak to you, so it shall be well with you, and your soul shall live. But if you refuse to surrender, this is the word that the Lord has shown me. Now behold, all the women who are left in the king of Judah's house shall be surrendered to the king of Babylon's princes. And those women shall say, Your close friends have set upon you and prevailed against you. Your feet have sunk in the miry, and they have turned away again. So they shall surrender all your wives and children to the Chaldeans. You shall not escape from their hand, but shall be taken by the hand of the king of Babylon, and you shall cause this city to be burned with fire. Then Zedekiah said to Jeremiah, Let no one know of these words, and you shall not die. But if the princes hear that I have talked with you, and they come to you and say to you, Declare to us now what you have said to the king, and also what the king said to you. Do not hide it from us, and we will not put you to death. Then you shall say to them, I presented my request before the king, that he would not make me return to Jonathan's house to die there. Then all the princes came to Jeremiah and asked him, and he told them according to all these words that the king had commanded. So they stopped speaking with him, for the conversation had not been heard. Now Jeremiah remained in the court of the prison until the day that Jerusalem was taken. And he was there when Jerusalem was taken. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.